you've had Lockie around too? Yeah, it's been good. Yeah, I've, I've played a bit of footy with Lock uh, before we both got drafted to our initial clubs. So, um, yeah, it's good to be back together and mucking around. It's good. Club showed some really good signs on the weekend. Yeah, yeah, we uh, we had a practice game the week before, and um, certainly we were a long way off where we wanted to be. So um, I think, you know, it's early on. We're, we're just trying to stick to a process at the moment, not worry too much about results. But um, yeah, it was it was good. We we sort of executed what we wanted to work on during the week, and um, yeah, it turned out all right. Lions fans all over Australia who are. Had their heart in their mouth when they saw Charlie limp off, but he's okay apparently. He's great. Yeah, he's fine. Yeah, um, it was a pretty hot day out there, and um, you know we're all we're all going to probably cramp in the first few rounds, and that and that was just another one of those. So probably didn't look great, but um, yeah, he's fine. He's he's out there having a kick with us today, and good to go this week. I'm pretty sure. And it's going to be a big weekend for the Lions with all three the women's AFL and the NEFL out there. Yeah, it is. It's it's a big weekend. Um, we don't think it's ever been done before. All three teams travelling into state, so. Um, it's pretty exciting. We're pretty keen to all just stick to it, stick together, and um, enjoy the weekend, and get down and watch the girls down at uh, Case uh, Case of Fields uh, on Sunday as well. So um, yeah, it should be good. You've had a had a fair share of injuries yourself. Have you sort of felt a change up here the pre-season? Um, oh, I've heard Fake saying you've done every single session. That, that's got to be a good step in my direction. Yeah, it is. It's uh, it's probably rare for me to be honest to get through that many sessions. So. Um, yeah, I've just I've, I've enjoyed just training to be honest. Um, when you spend a fair bit of time out, you, all you want to do is train and run and um, do all the things that you probably complain about a bit when you when you're up and going. So um, just really enjoying that, and um, the warm weather's been good for the bones so far. So we'll keep it going. <laughs> oh, you learn to love it. <laughs> and, and, and you can tell on the weekend, like you you know you it almost like you put your hand up to say. I'm here and I, I want to be part of this team and you really sort of, you know, um, took control in certain parts of the game. Yeah, I, yeah, I think we, as a forward line, we all just probably, uh, we're starting to gel a little bit better. Um, we were a long way off the week before, like I said earlier, so, um, yeah, we're just trying to play a sort of a selfless brand of footy and Lock, Lockie mentioned that, that earlier and that got taken out of context a bit as well, so, um, yeah, we're all just trying to work together and, um, and gel and this is the perfect time of year to do that, so. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll keep working. From the outside looking in, when you were looking at the Lions from, uh, from another club last year, what, what the Lions were doing? Yeah, it was, it's always hard to know exactly what's, what's really going on, but um, yeah, from the outside in, just looked like an exciting brand of footy. Um, obviously a pretty young group as well, so sort of thought that there's, it's uh, trending in the right direction, um, albeit there's a lot of work to do, so um, I'm just happy to be part of the uh, the build and um, yeah we'll see how we go this year. Uh, there's no no individual, um, just just as a as a group though I enjoyed watching them and that's about all I knew and then I talked to a couple of former teammates from Geelong and um, Alan Christensen and Josh Walker and they said um, how much they're, they're loving it up here and they feel like the club's heading in the right direction so um, yeah I was keen to jump on board. You just mentioned that Lockie's comments the other day were taken out of context. In what way? Oh, yeah. I probably shouldn't even have brought it up to be honest. But uh, yeah, um, Lockie, Lockie just said he's trying. The team's trying to play a selfless brand of footy, um, and uh, yeah, it's sort of just they, it's, they ran with it. But that, that, that's their opinion, and um, that's fine. So that's what we're here for. We're here to uh, make a bit of fun of it, and um, yeah, it's all good. I think, I think maybe that was taking out of context saying that the wife off the too much. I think I read a few people saying that. That's not how it's interpreted though. No, nah, certainly not. Not from speaking a lot uh, yesterday, so yeah. It'll be fine. Speaking of that self-defense, it seemed like on the weekend Yeah, we're just, uh, we're, we're all really different players, I guess. Um, so we're all going to try and turn up and put the pressure on because we know we've got players like Charlie and, and Cam and Hipwood, um, Dan McStay, a lot of guys down there with different weapons, I guess. So um, if we all turn up and put the pressure on, I think that's only going to create opportunities and um, 
hopefully, yeah, we start making the most of those. <laughs> nah, not really. <laughs> nah, oh, nah, no idea to be honest. I, I guess we're just good mates and um, back playing together, so you can call us the Bash Brothers if you like, but yeah, we're all just part of 22 players. <laughs>